you like our content, please like, subscribe, and click the notification bell to get alerts when we introduce new videos. This video will demonstrate how to enable remote management for your Unleashed network using the Unleashed mobile app. This is a great feature for remote management of a customer site. A typical use case for this feature is as follows. A partner or reseller sets up an unleashed network for a customer on the customer's premise. After configuring the network, they then set up the remote management using a social media login account such as Twitter, Google, or Facebook while on the premise and connected to the unleashed network. As a note, to set up remote management, you have to physically be connected to the unleashed network at the location where the network is installed. Once the remote login is set up, they can remotely manage the Unleashed network from any distant location. Why use social login? It allows you to manage an Unleashed network remotely and locally without altering firewalls. You can manage multiple Unleashed networks with a single sign-on. Up to 10 Unleashed networks can be remotely managed, and you can access Unleashed networks from multiple devices. When launching the Unleashed mobile app and logging into the Unleashed network for the first time, you'll be asked whether you want to enable remote management. If you answer yes, then you'll select a social media platform such as Twitter, Google, Facebook, or a custom selection, and then you'll enter the admin username and password for the Unleashed account and log in. From this point on, the partner or reseller or end user can be anywhere with Wi-Fi connectivity and launch the Unleashed mobile app to log in to the network and manage it. Let's go through a short live demo to demonstrate how this process is done. After connecting to the local Unleashed wireless LAN, then you would tap on Manage Network, and you'll put in your admin name and password. And then I'll log in, and it'll ask me, do you want to remotely manage this network? I'm going to say yes, and it'll show you how. And then it says, all you need to do is log in once with a social account below. So I'm going to tap on Log In with Google, and I'll choose an account. And it says adding this network for management. It says the network was added, but the notification is disabled on this network. And we can set up that notification later. So I'm going to go to the dashboard. And there we have it. We're now logged into the dashboard of this Unleashed network. And if I tap on that, you can see that this is the Awani Studio Corporation office. So I'll go back to that. We have five clients. We have one WLAN. And we have two APs. Now, if I tap on my upper right corner it brings up a menu and then if I wanted to set up for remote management what I could do is tap on remote management I could invite for remote management and I could send an invite by email or by text and that person would then receive the email or text and then they would follow the link to be able to manage that network so we're going to cancel on this I can also go to my settings and I can set up my notification and make sure that that notification is turned on if I wanted to turn off notifications for example if I didn't want to receive a lot of notifications in my email or my text, I could turn that off. So we'll keep that on as well. And if I go to the top of the menu, you'll see the drop-down menu at the top, and you'll see that we have two networks here. We have the Awani Art Unleashed, and we have the Awani Studio Corporate Office. And I could have up to 10 networks that I could manage. So it's that simple to configure remote management of your Unleashed network using social media. Just remember that you can add and manage up to 10 remote social login networks, and once they are set up locally, you can log in remotely from any location.